Hey guys, welcome back. Now, I know it's been quite a while, about two months now, but we're back with Giannis for the finals. Now, I've decided that once the series is over with, I'm going to explore more game options like RPGs and or MMOs, but let me know what you think down below. Um, this has been... It's been a long time coming. I'm so sorry that I didn't get these finals done uh, a lot. You know, with school and wrestling and stuff like that. It's, it's been a long, long two months. But I am back now here with Kostas. Hopefully able to bring this three seed to the championship. And uh, <laughs> luckily, uh, luckily we are the third seed. But, yep, we're here to try to get Kostas a championship ring. And honestly, uh, let me know down below. It's been a long time. Do you guys still want me to continue with this series? I have a lot of video game ideas in my head. Um, there's plenty of games I love, like Dark Souls, like the whole series, and a lot of shooter games, and you know, even stuff like Overwatch or um, Paladins has been really cool recently, or even Modern Warfare. So let me know what you guys think about that. Uh, again, I'm really sorry. It's been two months, probably closer to two and a half now since um, some of the videos, and it's probably almost been three months since the first video, and by the way, thank you guys so much for the support. Even while I was gone, we were getting more subscribers, and we'd gotten a few hundred more views since, you know, pretty much my disappearance, so thank you guys so much. I'm sorry I uh, disappeared like that, but I am here ready to make more videos, and hopefully we can get through all of these. Now, real quick rundown. Uh, we still do have Kosis as an 85 three-point shooter, uh, but he's really good in close at 90. He has an 80 standing dunk, 75 driving. Uh, he has 85 defensive rebound, 75 offensive rebound. He's got some pretty okay consistencies during the 70s. He's got 95 strength, 80 stamina. Um, I believe somebody wanted me to work more on his mid-range, so I will definitely probably think about doing that um here after this video but uh <laughs> it's been quite a while since i've used kosis so let's see how we do and uh i'll be back in a second see you guys here we are boys with kosis now this is the entrance of the game so we'll see how he does uh remember this is the finals for i believe his first yeah yeah this is his uh no this is his second they didn't make the playoffs the first time, if I remember correctly. It's been a long time, boys. It's been a long, long time. But we're definitely going to try making the best out of this opportunity. And I forgot. I can never make the first one. I can green the second one, boys. Okay, let's get it. Now, DeAndre Jordan has the starting center spot. Um, I believe Kosis is a power forward, if... I remember correctly. Um, mm, so I think we're behind Lori Markinen. It's like that or something. Dang. Way to start off the game with a foul. Um, now I definitely wanted to try working in music into my videos, but I haven't found a reliable way of getting um music into my videos that isn't copyrighted so as soon as i can figure out how to do that i will definitely have background music but uh for now i just won't have background music and i hope that doesn't bother too many of you guys now oh my god i'm going from my uh shooting guard in my career to coast this and oh my since it's been two months since I've used him I forgot how slow his free throw was Ooh, definitely there we go now what do you guys think you think we're gonna beat Celtics I mean they're a really good team now I don't know if they have all the players uh, that they do normally. I believe Jason Tatum probably left, if I'm correct. Oh my god, we just got dunked on by Jalen Brown. Oh. 
but the way he's playing like it this year, it might happen. Remember, you guys can't can't let me go. I'll shoot the three ball. Point Costas, bet. Oh my God, we're gonna draw all the fouls. Costas, Costas is actually the beard now. Except he can't make him. Can't green him. I don't know why I can't green him. Green? Okay, there we go. There we go. I'm still early. Now, we're going for a double double this game, and who knows? Maybe we'll go for high assist, high rebounds. You never know. What's this guy doing? Nope. No way. We're in his face. Oh my god. Laurie. Come on. I don't mean the. Bicker. Oh, that's not who I wanted to pass to. Come on. This game has been doing it to me all this time. It does not like me passing at all. I can pass directly to the right, and it's going to pass forward. I swear. Let's get it up there. And here is Sadaransky. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Do they remember us? I was off shot. Back to Markinen. Inside. There we go. Let's get it. Now I'm, I'd have to refresh myself on the badges we have. Uh, I'm guessing we have forms of rim protector and or rebound chaser. Mm, probably some form of finishing. Yeah, what was that? Contact finisher maybe? Uh, we have something like that. I know we have defensive badges. I'm pretty sure we have rebound chaser. And I think on top of that we also have um, maybe some form of offensive badges which would make sense that's kind of how he plays uh, pretty good defensively pretty good offensively they must not remember how well uh, he shoots they were 85 85 three you can't you cannot disrespect the 85 three Oh dang. Ah, uh, you won't get it though. Come on. Oh my god, get out my way. What a disrespectful move by 2K. Nine seconds, boys. Come on. That, that's not Kostas. Come on. He also has a 95 strength. Let's not forget about that. Definitely got to use that. Come on. Yes, that's a make. Okay, let's get it. I'm... I forget how we used to play Kosas. I'd like to say we ran a bunch of pick and rolls, but... I can't remember for the life of me. Oh, no, can't let Jalen do that. Oh, like I said, can't let Jalen do that. Well, this is interesting. Oh, by the way, uh, hopefully you guys had a great, you know, holiday. Like, I, ho I hope your holidays were re really good. Like, Thanksgiving and all that. All that went really well for you guys. Especially Christmas. And especially if anybody had any birthdays during the holidays. Hopefully that went great. Uh, me personally, I had a really good um, Christmas and stuff, so hopefully you guys did too. And hopefully you guys had a good New Year's as well. A lot of new gaming stuff that came out, that's for sure. Oh, don't even get me started on this Google Stadia. Oh, maybe not everything was great. Well, already the second quarter. 14 points. Drop stepper. Dang. His steal is horrible, by the way. I mean, steal is horrible. Ghostus cannot steal the ball. But he can block, and he definitely can contest. What are you doing? 
Mate, come on. This is supposed to be a finals game, not a I'm gonna step out of bounds and let him sh- oh no. No way. Dang it. He closed it. He closed the distance. Do they have Cantor? Do they have Cantor? I'm not missing Cantor, am I? Cantor's a boatload of ass. Okay. Marking in. I know you're trash in real life right now, but. Oh, it's green. Oh my god. Green bean. Let's get it. I knew Costa was going to make it. So he's got volume. So he's got like bronze shooting badges and stuff. Okay. <laughs> we are 17 and 3 right now. Beginning of the second. I forget how many minutes this guy has. He, he probably has in like the 20s. I would guess something like that. Oh my god. Come on. He, he must not be able to shoot. I can't imagine why he wouldn't want to shoot that. Wow. Ed David. Oh, you know what? I remember this guy. Yeah, he can't shoot. Never mind. Never mind. Look at that. D mid range on the right. Nasty. A plus paint, A blocks, <laughs> F steals, D perimeter. I feel like Tosa's be a pretty fast guy. No way. Green. Dang, Green Bean. Okay. 40-39. It's been a really close game. Dang, Kimba's been doing really good in this game. Oh, is Kimba on me right now? R really? Come on. The second I find out I have Kimball Walker on me. What are you doing? Get Costas! A plus perimeter D. And you... Oh, oh, I thought they were disrespecting me. Mm, yeah, I'm definitely taking it to you guys. Oh my god. No? Oh, that was like a double block right there. <laughs> oh, that's... Ooh. 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 Nope. Not happening, I guess. Mm-mm. <laughs> we ain't taking that. Boys, who's, be who's ready to pick and roll me? Oh, come on, Jordan. By the way, not even like an hour and a half ago, I may have found the most cheese build on my career. It's a glass cleaner, but it's a playmaking glass cleaner. Now... When you think of glass cleaners, you don't really think of very offensive people. But I'm telling you, a power forward, playmaking glass cleaner. That's what it's called. Now, some of you may know what I'm talking about. But for the people that don't know what I'm talking about, oh my god. Talk about 6-8, power forward. Name Zion Williamson. That, that's that's his name currently on my my career. And <laughs> he has a mid seventy ball control, like a seventy one or seventy two three point. And this is it, it um, you know your max, mid seventy three, a mid to high, a mid to high mid range. So you can shoot. As long as you have your shooting badges, which, by the way, you get 10 shooting badges if you do it the same way I did it and this other guy did it. And then, you still have an 89 defensive rebound and, like, an 82 offensive rebound. You get, like, a mid-80 block. Forget about steals. When you have, like, freaking, when you have miniature arms, and you don't, like, it doesn't matter if you have, like, a 75 steal or 80 steal. It's useless. And so, we're over here... I, you even have like an 86 driving dunk. 
like an eight you have like an 80 driving layup like the build is it's 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 like nothing i've ever seen he the build has like a 90 speed when you have it at 99 90 speed and you have it at like high 80 acceleration what do you do against a 6'8 guy that i don't want to take that i want to lay up well, what are you going to do against a guy <laughs> that's 6'8 and has the same speed as a point guard? You can't. And then, coupled with the speed and the ball handling, if you get your takeover, you can speed boost. So now you have a speed boosting power forward who's 6'8 can lock you down, is almost like a lockdown defender, can lock you down can defend almost every position because you're so freaking fast and then you can shoot as long as you have the badges like that that's insane to me like I don't, uh, you guys got to tell me your interesting builds because i'm about to do a build showcase because this stuff is actually insane Kim was actually trying to like shoot over a massive like like on the on the wall the Great Wall of China. And he's not getting any blocks. He an 80, so I, I guess I can't really complain too much. An 80, 80 overall block. That'll get you like a block or two per game. Maybe three if you really know what you're doing. Um, this build only has three rebounds though. I'm kind of getting them stolen from me a little bit. Um, he has an 85 defensive rebound and a 75 offensive rebound. So, if we don't pull out at least 7 or 8 rebounds by the end of this game, we have not been doing our job. Uh, he has horrible passing, but still, we should probably get at least 2 assists. Um, and I'm... We'll see. We're trying to get, like, 30-ish points. I think a 38 and 2 game would be good for Costas over here. So, like I said earlier in the beginning of the video, uh, definitely want to broad out my options. A pretty close game right there, except for seals. I want to broad out my options for games. Um, I've been kind of falling off of NBA a little bit. Uh, it's been out for a couple months now, and. Honestly, after a couple months, you kind of want to play other things. So I hope you can't blame me for wanting to branch out a little bit. I know this is where I'm started and where I get my fan base. But at the same time, if I only play a specific game and don't find out if I have better success anywhere else, then I'll never know. But uh, I kind of want to see how RPGs do because I, I love RPGs. They're like... They're, they're like my favorite genre. You got uh, things like uh, Outer Worlds, Skyrim, uh, some of the Fallout games. Fallout 76, I did not like at all. I played for like I played for like seven hours, not gonna lie, and I played with some friends, and I don't know. I didn't get the same feeling as like Fallout 3 and New Vegas and all that. Kind of Fallout 4, nah. Fallout 4 wasn't as good in my opinion, but it was still a good game. What? That's not a foul. Ref, you're tripping. But, um, yeah, yeah. Like I was saying, I want to branch out. Uh, even Modern Warfare. Uh, I probably have... I don't have the most amount of time on that. I have about 32 hours on, I'd say. Um, yeah, it's... My career rank's probably like 80 or something. So, nothing massive. Uh, but... Yeah, I hope you can't blame me for wanting to branch out a little bit. Uh, definitely, after you play a lot of NBA 2K, and I'm talking about, like, once you already have, you know, a main... Once one of your characters is already in the 90s and stuff, and you've played him a decent bit... Oh, green again! Green bean! But, like, once you already have a character that's already in the 90s, and... You've tried out a couple builds and you're just not feeling it and you've kind of stopped when they're in the high 70s because I haven't spent 
I maybe spent like five dollars on my main character just to bring him up like three overall or something. Uh, so he could become like a 92 from like an 89. But other than that, like I'm not trying to spend money on this game. Um, I, I just don't feel like it's a wise idea to spend money on this game, at least not for me. Maybe for some of you guys. But um, I don't know. I'm just not spending money on this game. Uh, I'm not trying to speed up my grinding process. Um, but in general, I don't know. I just want to expand, if you know what I mean. Because uh, I'm, I'm sure a lot of you probably like more than just NBA uh, games. You know, I'm sure you like Call of Duty or you like uh, Skyrim, the Fallout series, maybe Outer Worlds. Because uh, that came out a little bit ago, and I'm not going to lie, I'm not a big fan. I haven't played too much, but I've watched a lot, and it's pretty fun, not going to lie. Um, and so that would be really fun, and maybe you want me to brought out on the type of sports games I play. Maybe you want me to play NFL, or uh, maybe even some of the show. I've actually played a decent bit of the show, maybe, maybe two days worth of time. So I kind of know what I'm doing. I played a lot of just like career mode. But uh, I just want to branch out, find multiple audiences, and then on top of those multiple audiences, have a fan base that can enjoy multiple things. I don't want to stick to one thing. Though. A lot of you might be saying right now, like, Agent, what are you doing? Like, this is where you started. This is this is where your fan base is. I have I have 77 subscribers, and you all have been doing an amazing job. Um, the past three months, we've earned like 3,000-ish views. I've earned 3,000-ish views, um, dozens of likes. Uh, maybe like two dozen comments a lot of them telling me that I'm doing a great job and giving me little like tips on and stuff they would like to see more and that has been great and that is definitely helping me increase my pr uh, productivity on this you know on this media and as just increasing my fan base and all that and growing my content and stuff and that has been fantastic. But I just want to broad out a little bit and get to more people like you guys. You guys love watching 2K games. And I want to get to more people that also have the same passion, but for like their games. So I love Dark Souls, for instance. I've probably said this like three, four times now. Um. I've been in every game except Demon Souls. I haven't had the chance to play Demon Souls since it's on uh, PS3, and I'm hoping they remaster it because I've watched probably two full playthroughs of it. And in my opinion, it's probably tied for my second best Dark Souls. Um, for me personally, Dark Souls 2 is my favorite, and it's tied with Dark Souls 1 for me. Uh, and then, personally, um, I can't really rank Dark Souls 3 and Bloodborne the same way as the others, because Bloodborne's, it's a Souls game, but not really, if that makes sense. It's Bloodborne, it's not, it's not Dark Souls, it's not Demon Souls, it's a Soulsborne game. And so, i probably say Bloodborne and Dark Souls 3 gave me the same feeling when I played both of them. Uh, it was exciting, but I don't know. I kind of like the nostalgia of the other games. I think nostalgia just kind of pushes me over it a little bit. But, um... Definitely would like to play more RPGs. Uh, definitely want to play MMOs too. Um, I wouldn't be doing any series with MMOs. Uh, I'm like 
obviously if it's like Outer Wo Worlds or like Skyrim, those are RPGs and you have to kind of make series out of it. But if it's like Modern Warfare, it wouldn't really be a series, it'd be like the Rage compilations and stuff. <laughs> because of like Claymores and stuff. I know what I know you guys all know what I'm talking about if you played Modern Warfare. Oh, it's a constant <laughs> rage fest. Like you could be, you could be like an 80 or you could be like level 80, and you could have a level. Let's say you have a 70 MP5, and you're really good, and you have like a one point like 3k to or something. You're you're doing pretty good at the game. You know what you're doing. Honestly, like I can't, I can't remember a time when I could go a few games without seeing claymores blowing up me or my teammates. And because of that, I just decided, you know what, we're not using claymores, we're using uh, the mines, the landmines, if we're using anything like that. So, uh, if I was to play any MMOs, it would not be a series. I don't play MMO campaigns. Um, I, I just never seem to finish them. Black Ops 3, Black Ops 4, Black Ops 2, Black Ops 1. Uh, the other, the older COD games, like the rate, the older COD 4, uh, COD Remastered, um, I, COD 4 and COD Remastered, uh, Modern, Modern Warfare Remastered, I played 80% the way through and I could just never finish it for some reason, and same thing with this campaign, I just can't seem to finish it, uh, I play about halfway through and I just lose interest, um, though I will say Modern Warfare, uh, Remastered had a really good campaign, you know, COD 4 had a really good campaign, um, but, I don't know, but, uh, enough of me talking about, like, the future of my, uh, channel, just let me know down in the comments, what do you want me to do, and, uh, Ghostus is 38, 9, I believe he probably has, like, I think he has a steel, he might have a block, I'm not 100% sure, but he's getting some points for this. And actually, at the end of this, I'm going to tally up how much XP I get, and I'm going to do it right in front of you guys, since, I, I don't know, I just, I feel like I could just do it right here. Like, I'm right, I'm right here on my computer, like, hear this? Like, I could do it right here. I could do it right here at the end of the game. And I can tell you what I'm leveling up and what it all is. So other than the fact that you're going to hear my mouse click and maybe my keyboard, you're going to know I'm doing it right here in front of you. And green bean. Oh my god, come on, come on, come on. You got to get 40. You got to get 40. Yes, let's get it! Guys, we just hit 40 points on Kostas. Is this a career high for him? 40 points? Imagine getting a 40 point double-double. I think we've gotten a 30 point double double. Oh my god, 40 point double double. That'd be really good for Ghost. He's not even a starter. Dang, if I could make my career players like this, like normal my career, that would be insane. You wanna pot me open? You wanna, you wanna. No points in the game yet for him. Just five on the clock. Loads it up for Young. Let's get it! And that's how you throw an alley-oop. Sadly, Thaddeus had to, you know, take it down a little bit. Do a little windmill there. He didn't dunk it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Double-double. Let's get it, boys. You didn't think I'd get a double-double while talking, did you? Well, I did. You won't. You won't. Oh, come on. Oh, definitely mine. Oh, my God. Oh, oh. And we're... Hey, I said we had to get at least two assists, didn't I? And we just got it. Dang, 56%? We're shooting 56%. God, I can only imagine what Coast is at. He must be at 70% right now. hes I don't think he's missed, like, more than five shots or something. Or maybe I'm just not remembering correctly. That's big boys. That's big boys. Two. Oh, come on. 
And remember, this is on Hall of Fame difficulty. I do not sim off of Hall of Fame difficulty because that's way too easy. I could go out there with a 65 overall and probably score 10 points, especially on pro or even rookie. You're behind me. Markinen, what are you doing? He's tripping on his own shoe. You won't. Ha ha. I feel like Kawhi Leonard. Ha ha. Ah, Kawhi's cool. Oh, is that the end of the game? Ooh! We're up 1 0, baby. 1 by 12. Let's get it. Let's see how the team did in total. Oh, yes, yes. Confetti everywhere. Okay. Really? We missed nine? I can't remember asking. Okay, so 40, 11, 2, and 1. 13 to 22. So that's probably like 54, 55% from field goal. 40% uh, from three. Four fouls. Markinen did really good. Darren Fox did pretty good. Uh, Zach Levine even did half decent. Auto Porter efficient. Jordan, he got rebounds. So Daddy's young. It's about uh, all they can really do right now for us. So let me set my controller down, just like that. Move my mic a little bit and type this stuff in for you guys. So we are 13 for 22, uh, two for five for three, uh, 12 for 16 <laughs> from free throw, uh, 11 rebounds. Two assists, steal, no blocks, four fouls, sadly. Uh, yes, we did win. Let me re-enter that. I must have entered that wrong. That didn't give us much XP. Give me a minute. Mm -hmm. Sometimes this bugs out here. Uh, 13. Mm -hmm. 12 for 16. 11 rebounds, 2 assists, a steal, off of the win, and there we go. Only 620 XP? Hmm, that's interesting. I don't know why it does that. Well, let's upgrade something at least. Um, I was told mid-range, so I think... Because I know he's defensively pretty good. <clears throat> so you don't have to worry about IQ much since I'm playing him. Uh, sorry guys, I gotta mute myself real quick. I'm gonna hack. We're back. Okay, so 85 open shot 3. AKA just 85-3. 90 shot close. Uh, 95 strength. 75 vertical, which is pretty good for his height. 80 stamina. Um... 80 block, 88 shot contest, 85 defensive rebound. Um, I think I'm just going to give him a mid shot or a mid range shot. So I guess let me just give him a jumper real quick. Yes. So he'll go from a 51 to a 65, which will help him a little bit. So, okay, let me come over here in the game. Uh, yes, we are officially 1 and 0. Uh, let's see how the other teams did real quick. I'm sure they were doing pretty good. So, yes, yes, yes. Thank you, thank you. Uh, we were the only team to play so far. Dang. Okay, so let's come over here. Kosas is an 83. So let's go over to edit. Attributes. And go to his... Now, some of these are going to be a tiny bit off. Maybe a point or two off. Uh, I can't really help it too much. I can only fix it if I have to upgrade them, really. Um, 65. Okay. Still an 83. So he's an A- minus inside, a C- mid now. A three-pointer, A- minus inside D. D- minus perimeter D, sadly. D- minus playmaking. But A- minus rebound, B- plus physical... Only D plus IQ, but that's really if we're not playing him. Um, and then A minus potential, which is 
that that just stays with us. So we had a pretty good game, and we're going to be doing really good, especially when we come over here and hopefully <laughs> beat Boston. But thank you guys so much. Uh, I had an amazing time making this video, and it definitely was a relief to finally make a video for you guys. It's been a quite a long time. So, um, like I said, just if you're here at the end, uh, leave a comment down below just telling me um, what do you guys think about my idea on branching out a little bit. Uh, I love NBA games, but I have to branch out if this channel is going to get any bigger. Um, it has definitely grown. I was at like 53 subs before the series, and now I've gained like 24, 25 new subscribers, all because of NBA in the series. And that doesn't really hit you until you really look at the numbers and you're like, that's like half of what I had before it just added on top of what I had so I've grown 33 percent guys or actually 50 percent so thank you guys so much and I hope you guys enjoyed and I will really like I know I have wrestling and stuff so it may be a little sketch when I have time uh it may only be once a week it may be twice a week it may be three times a week it may just be when I can get it out to you guys but trust me, I'm going to try getting one out at least a week. I know I can get one out, and I can hopefully get two out. And so I'll definitely let you guys know. Thank you guys so much for the support. Honestly, I sincerely mean this. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.